Alright guys, I've just thought of a way directory support will work. So, I'm just going to open Silk Rock Hive, I'm going to call it direct directories, alright? And any file I wish to be act added would be MC, would be MC Geeks Authenticator, slash, okay, and then this is where it comes in. So you go MC Geeks Authenticator, slash, okay, and now I'm going to find my MC Geeks Authenticator directory. Which is right on my desktop somewhere. It's on here somewhere. It's on here somewhere. 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 There it is. Okay, there it is. Um, so MTX Authenticator slash off server dot moyen dot com dot cert, for example. All right. So that would be that would be the name of the file of the file would be mcx authenticator slash off server dot moyang dot com dot cert all right and then the file i wish to add would also would just be this certification file all right and that is basically how it would work is you would just type in is you have to manually add each individual thing file to the directory like this off Authenticate or all right dot exe all right and then you would just drag and drop this in all right and then um m and then mcx authenticator slash session i'm just gonna copy and paste it Slash session server dot mojang dot com and then the file I wish to archive would be the session server dot mojang dot com. All right, and there we go. Um, that would add all three of those files, and as you'll see here, if I open um directories dot silica. All right, you'll see here we have um mcx authenticator slash off server dot mojang dot com dot cert and that is this file here and then we have mcx authenticator right? we end it there and then we go mcx authenticator slash mcx authenticator dot exe and we have all of the exe stuff and then under that we would have um mcx authenticator slash m session server dot moving com and if we were to extract this we would see the file name here and then the slash and so we say, okay, this is meant to be inside a directory. And so we would then extract this file here and put it inside a directory. And that is how we would have directory support inside direct inside dot silica files. Um, all right. So yeah, when you're coding your extractors, keep that in mind. That is how you do directories. Um, and if you're planning on making a better archival, um, well, I suggest that someone does this because typing in slash the 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 folder path would get pretty annoying probably very quickly you can probably automate it so it would automatically add every single um you could probably add like whole folders in it and it would automatically like add every single one file in it to the archive or whatever um anyway that's about it though for this so yeah bye